Hi there, I'm Anya from Peony and Time, which is a small shop for knitwear and knitting patterns. You can find me on Etsy, on Instagram, and Facebook, all at Peony and Time. I'm most active though on Instagram because it's my favorite. So, today, I'm so excited to share with you. I have some very exciting news. Um, if you watched my most recent video, you know that I have had a couple collaborations in the works that I'm very excited about, and I finally get to tell you about one of them. So, I just received in the mail today something just truly amazing. Look at this! <laughs> That's right. I got crazy amazing giant yarn. This is from Sarah over at Mama Knows Luxury. I will put a link to her shop in the description below um, because you're gonna wanna go check it out. It's oh, it's amazing. After actually like getting my hands on this, you guys, I can't even believe like it's a whole different ball game. Um, the stuff I had been using before was this raw wool roving, which is like a really nice color, but you can kind of see there. Um, it's just like really rough. I think it was from an Icelandic um, sheep <laughs> and it's really nice and sturdy but it's super rough and just not something you really want to like cuddle with and have right next to your face. And it did make like a nice blanket. So it looks like this. It's just a little shorty like a lap throw. Partially because I ripped some of it out because I wanted to experiment with pre-felting. So yeah, so it's like a nice blanket but it's very, very coarse. Not something you really want to snuggle with at all which is alright if you just want it for looks, but it, you know, if you have a blanket you kind of just want to cuddle with it. But just today the shipment arrived with this giant yarn and you guys, I, I just wish, I can't even tell you <laughs> how soft this is. After working with the raw wool roving, it's a whole different world. It's crazy. It's like, I don't know, if it were like a spider's web, but not creepy and also still like really strong. Check that out. Anyhow, let me see. I wonder if I can lift this up a little bit so you can see. Um, the awesome thing is she sent me a whole huge ball of this um, so it will be able to be a, like a continuous blanket and it's like the most amazing giant fluffy bird's nest <laughs> you can imagine. Yes. So, can you see that? Yeah, anyhow, it's wonderful and I just kind of want to cuddle with it. So yeah. It's amazing. This color is graphite. It's a brand new one that she is just releasing in the shop. You can kind of see it's all, it's really close to black, but not quite. It's more like kind of a deep charcoal. One thing I like about that is um, I really love black yarn, but it is so hard to photograph. Oh my gosh. And I've already um, done a little bit of photo testing with this one. And just like that little bit of grayness to it makes it photograph so much better. So, I am going to be designing a blanket, which I am thrilled about. <laughs> it's like dream, dreams coming true here. Yeah, so I'm going to be designing a textured blanket and um, then it will become a kit hopefully that will be in her shop so that then if you like it, you can go get one for yourself. So I'll be doing a how-to video showing exactly how I make the blankets. And then I'm also going to be doing a tutorial on um, preparing the roving beforehand, just kind of doing like a nice light felting process. Um, Cause that was one of the things that I was concerned about with the giant knitting was that um, I had heard that it like pilled and shedded a lot. And you know, it's kind of an investment to get a blanket size amount of fiber. And so I didn't really want to spend a bunch of money and then end up with something that was gonna be falling apart. So Sarah was telling me how I can lightly felt it and then it will just be so much stronger and hold up a lot better. So I'll be um, working with her to try and figure out the best way to lightly felt this. And we'll be doing a step-by-step -step tutorial so you can do it too. She's also really generously offered a coupon code in case you want um, I'm pretty sure it's 10% off I will put the coupon code up on the screen here so if you want to get some of your own that will be a nice time to take advantage of that anyhow after we have finished the blanket designing and the kit Sarah has also generously offered to do a giveaway so we'll be doing um, a giveaway of the blanket design that I'm making so you can get your own kit if you want and knit up your own. If you, like me, have all sorts of really wonderful giant blanket knitting dreams, they could be about to come true. <laughs> also, 
I can 100% say I recommend working with Sarah. She has been so, so nice. Again, just what I keep on finding on Instagram here, it's just such a great community. And um, I'm meeting so many, so many people who have become friends. And so, yeah, she's been so helpful, just gone above and beyond any time that I've had questions. She takes like, a lot of time answering them. It's just really kind and personable. And basically, yeah, Sarah, I wish you didn't live so far away because I kind of just want to sit down over coffee and <laughs> chat about life with you. So yeah, I 100% recommend their product and working with them. It's been awesome so far and I'm really excited to keep you posted and should be showing you updates of the blanket as I'm working on it. So I hope you guys are excited for some fun tutorial videos on this and a super exciting giveaway coming up and Yes, that's about it. So yeah, anyhow, thanks for listening to all of this excited rambling. I'm really excited to keep you guys posted on progress. All right, bye. I'll just be over here just cuddling, just cuddling with this yarn. <laughs> it's so nice, you guys, it's so soft.